More on that in a moment. Third down and nine. Across the middle, Hillis. It'll be fourth down. Let's talk about Glenn Dorsey. McFadden is the deep back. Hillis. They give it to Hillis, and he appears to have easily have a first down at the 21-yard line. Peyton Hillis. David Lee was talking about this uh, fellow who was injured last year and said he has tremendous hands. Yes. Runs a 4-5-40. Goes about 245 pounds. He's their leading receiver. He has played some tailback this year. We didn't see him last year when they made that run to the SEC West. He was injured and had horrendous numbers. Three of 17 for 29 yards in that 31-26 thriller. Play fake. Dick looks deep left side. Fires it. Caught. Peyton Hillis with the first down at the 26-yard line. Craig. Now two and three men with his attack. Back spasms and a knee problem. McFadden will get the direct snap now. And off Hillis. Hillis. Peyton Hillis being chased but will not be caught. 65-yard touchdown. Pictures of Frank Broyles. They named the field after him. Well, here's the wishbone right here. Snap to the quarterback. Ride the fullback. Give it to the fullback. Goes right up the gut. Everybody's looking for the pitch. Everybody is out there playing assignment football to the outside of the formation, and you gash him inside. Dorsey could not get off the block, and they gashed it right at him. Peyton Hillis goes 65, and the Hogs go back on top. No quarterback in the game. Yeah. There's a handoff to Hillis. And it'll bring up third down, five or six, depending on the spot. Final 80 seconds, quarter number three. Battle of the boot, Bo Pelini has seen his team gashed. Right on the ground. Well, last week it was a running, scrambling quarterback. Today, it's a running, scrambling running back, playing quarterback. Greg Stelts, All-American safety, third down. And again, it's McFadden who will take the snap. They bring it to Hillis, and he's going to be very close for the first down at the 39. How about that? Three plunges in a row right up the middle of that Defense, they feel they have the matchups in their favor right now in Arkansas. They've got Dorsey Gimpy. They've got a quarterback that can keep it at any second and go the distance, and they had a breakout play with the fullback. Top of the screen. McFadden pulls up down the middle. Peyton Hillis, touchdown, Arkansas. <laughs> Boom, there goes Hillis. Danny McCray, number 44, does not play it as well as Stelts. And almost an underthrow. He was so open, McFadden didn't want to overthrow the ball, and they get an easy touchdown. David Lee, the offensive coordinator, said he's got great hands. He's got Terry Glenn hands. That's what he said about him. You're right. Robert Johnson and Hillis break off wide to the right. Monk is the bottom of your screen. Well, LSU blitz. No. No. Dick with a lot of time. Good downfield coverage. He foul. Man, wide open. It's Hillis. And it's a first down for Arkansas. I see your fourth down play, and I raise you my fourth down play. Hillis was open for about five seconds on this play. Dick had to come out. A busted coverage by LSU. And Arkansas stays in the game. The ball, they love to throw it to that guy right there. He's in a slot right. They go in the end zone for him, and he has got it. Touchdown, Peyton Hillis. How about Casey Dick delivering that ball? I give him all the credit in the world. Well, he found Hillis on a fourth and ten, and then he finds Hillis for the touchdown. To extend this to a second overtime, Alex Tejada. Ooh. 
We're tied at 35. Same wheel route that Highsmith knocked down the one early. When they come in with 11 and they put number 22 right there, he's going to wheel right up the sideline. A perfect throw. Highsmith, same matchup. Throw better this time, and he beats number seven. Boy, that's well done. Give a lot of credit to David Lee, the offensive coordinator, who worked with Casey Dick and made him a respectable quarterback this year. Amazing, amazing football player he is. From the eye, they hand it off. Touchdown, Arkansas. Peyton Hillis gets another. You must go for two. You get the tailback running away from the play. The linebackers lean just a little bit and just hand it off inside. That guy is going to be playing on Sundays also, no doubt. Arkansas has called timeout to discuss the try.